everybody. So hey, top of the morning. Mm -hmm. So it's the beginning of our week. Beginning of your week and whenever you're watching this as well. Yeah. But where are we at? So we're in Rose City. Portland, Portland Oregon, Oregon to yeah. be more exact. Yeah. This wasn't our first idea of vacation because all of our out of the country trips got denied. But we're gonna make the best of it. We heard some good foods are here. We so heard plenty of good foods, lots and of good spots. Spots of sightseeing and all mm -hmm. that jazz. But uh we're gonna go pick up our, our car rental, right? Mm -hmm. And yeah, we'll go on from there. Let's so get started. some donuts from this spot called Pips. Pips donuts. donuts. Oh yeah, we got it's we got two of everything, right it's babe? Mini. Yeah. So they only have six flavors to choose from, so we got two of each. And so what we got um cinnamon sugar, cinnamon sugar with Nutella, honey, I think plain Nutella. I'm not sure what this is. I think this is their um seasonal favorite or their seasonal special, which is some type of lavender jam. And this one, interesting, it's bacon and maple, I think. I think I'm gonna try this. Alright. So, let's go. I heard that crunch. Mm hmm. Whoa. That was so good. A donut, not sweet at all, definitely a savory donut. Um, little hints of bacon, the bacon isn't overpowering. I'm not sure if there's maple in there. But there is some sea salt on top that gives it a nice kick. I really like this. Mm. I'm not a bacon person either, but this is really good. Mm. Mm -hmm. Alright, what are you gonna try next? My favorite probably will be the cinnamon sugar. It's never gonna go wrong. And it's crunchy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's all fluffy on the inside. Outside is extremely crunchy. It's all airy. Like as soon as you bite past that crunchy layer, it just purely melts in your mouth. You need that bite size, but I'm trying to be good and make it too. <laughs> all right, now third one for you. My third pick is the honey. Mm. Looks like a plain little donut. Damn, that crunch gets me every time. Mm -hmm. I'm salivating over here, babe. The honey's not too overpowering. There's little hints and notes within the donut. But it's a really good, like, plain donut. Alright, so I'm gonna try this one, the seasonal one, because Lily didn't try that one. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna just see how that tastes and what it is. I don't know, it looks, it looks purple, so it looks like. It's supposed to be some grape. type of lavender uh, jam, okay. I think. Mmm. I love it. Very good. Punchy. You have that definitely that lavender, lavender smell, mm -hmm. but it tastes like grape to me. Mm. But pretty good. Good, right? Mm -hmm. Now I'm gonna try a bacon one that you're talking about. Mm -hmm. It's good. Mm. It tastes like um smells for, cool. for all my Asian people. Good. Oddly, it tastes like a uh, chasu or like sasu, mm. the vin or the Chinese red pork. Ooh. It tastes like that, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. It's crazy. Wow. Oh, there's meat in there. Oh, there's meat. Bacon. Bacon. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. It tastes like the Chinese pork. This is bomb. I think this might be my favorite. I don't know. Let me try Nutella. Yeah, Nutella is all-time favorite. Mm. Crunchy. A little salty sweet in there. Mm-hmm. Mm. I love it. I'm going to try that Nutella. With the cinnamon, cinnamon sugar? Cinnamon sugar. Mm-hmm. Oh. Nutella, cinnamon sugar, and honey. Wow. It's all three. That's like all my favorites combined, babe. Mm-hmm. Jesus. Jesus Christ, how mm. crunchy it is. Oh. Perfect. <laughs> That's all he has to say. This is perfect. Oh my god. I think he's going into a lot Crunchy, of fluffy, um, sweet, obviously, from all the honey, the cinnamon, and Nutella. But, yeah, it's one hell of a mini donut. 
we might be coming back throughout this week. But oh, this, is yeah. a good, this is a good first bite of Portland. This is like close to our hotel, so there's no reason why not to come oh back. Oh my god, guys, and they have like these specialty ice creams here. Oh, yeah. We're gonna come back. We're gonna try those. that too. Oh, yeah. Now, this is plain as hell. more than me. <laughs> this is all for you, though, okay? Oh. Yeah, yeah, you liar. Good though. Cheers, guys. On to our next spot. See y'all in a bit. oysters for a while. Can't really tell the difference. They're good. So I got my, they call it Jake's Famous Ape Tuesday. Mm -hmm. And it has big chicken and crawfish shells. It's the only thing that they have crawfish in. Oh, yeah. So I had to get it. So Ape Tuesday is always really good. Um, it's more of like a southern Louisiana homey dish. Mm -hmm. I don't mind it. It's kind of like a, I guess a southern Americanized Rice and whenever you mix it in. It always scares me going to American spots where they have rice because I don't know if they cook it right. <laughs> Try to get a little bit of everything. Really hot, <laughs> but that's good. Flavors are there, but what is lacking is some spices. And I wish I brought my little Thank God, because <laughs> that could be a make or break. But a lot of crawfish tails in there, chicken. Yeah, it's good. All right. So I got Jake's clam chowder. Famous clam chowder. Oh, is it famous clam chowder? I don't know. <laughs> I hope it is. But uh, yeah, let's let's dig in. Let's dig. Oh, you have the oyster crackers too. Oh yeah, I'll put that in now. How is it? It's, it's good. It's nice and thick. A little sweet, kinda. Lots of clams? Mm. Oh, yeah. I didn't catch no clam. Let me try to get a clam there. Come on, that's the whole point of killing clam chowder. I know, but. Oh, there it is. Hot. Not spicy hot, but like temperature wise. Mm -hmm. Of course, but the clam is, is nice size. It's mm -hmm. chewy. It's good. I think, um, really say to. We're gonna try to we're gonna try to find some for our food. It'll make it so much better. Cause you know it's Asian. So much. Better. You know it's Asian. Spice is life, spice, man. Oh yeah. Anybody, come on. Well, yeah, it's good. Both 
both of us, first timers, mm -hmm. but also his first time yes. trying the infamous Xiao Long Bao, oh, yeah. which is the soup dumpling. There you go. First, you put it in the spoon like that. I just right. gave him a little tutorial right and before then this. You either punch, punch it or you bite it? Bite, bite a little hole. Okay, I'll bite it. And, to, and suck out a little bit of soup. Be careful, it's hot. Not too bad, not too bad. Yeah, yeah, for now, right. with the meat. Get a little bit. Come on. It ain't, it ain't coming, babe. I gotta do this. You suck. There you go. Come on, let's see, he's so messy. Are you ready? Yes. Good. First impression of how long? Oh, man. Wow. That's a wow. These little bites of Is it pork in there? Heaven. Uh, we got Is it pork, pork or and chicken? we also got shrimp. Oh, shrimp? I think I got pork in my mouth. Okay, pork. That was good. The, the, the broth that was in the soup was in there. That was, it wasn't like super hot at all. Mm -hmm. It was like, I wouldn't say lukewarm, mm -hmm. but it's, it's hot. Not it's a good it temperature. Your tongue, yeah. mm -hmm. The meat was really tender. Lots of flavor in there. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, and then the vinegar with the soy sauce. And ginger. Just, and ginger, yep. Added you know, the extra, extra flavoring to it. So. Mm -hmm. That's bomb. Mm -hmm. That's bomb. I don't know why I haven't been eating this. I need to, I need to catch up. See you know what, what I've been, see what's been lacking in your life? Me. Yes. Me. Yes. <laughs> you. I've been introducing him to a whole new world. So, so we just got our um, chili. We've got pork and shrimp, the spicy chili wonton. Mm -hmm. That sounds really good. Oh yeah. You can tell by her face. Look at that. The outside of the wonton is super tender. It's thick, but not too thick. It melts in your mouth. Mm -hmm. The chili is not too spicy. I wish it was, but it's still a nice little kick. Mm -hmm. um, inside pork and shrimp, super tender, super juicy. Excellent. Excellent. I am happy. Oh, yeah. yeah. The rest of our food came out. Oh, here. yeah. We got the buns. Yeah. Two types of buns, mm -hmm. more soup dumplings. More dumplings. Oh yeah, we got some ribs too. Oh, Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, now oh. I think that's it. <laughs> I think that's it, hopefully. <laughs> what else oh. you gonna try, babe? Got the green beans, they're so good. Oh, yeah. Y'all don't understand. If any of you guys watch Wally TV, they always go to Taipan, they always talk about this. So good, you're a garlic lover. Alright. What's that? What is that though, first off? There's a pork and shrimp shumai. Pork and shrimp shumai. Mm -hmm. That's so cute. <laughs> That's what she's looking at food as. Oh, it looks so cute. So I'm gonna eat it. Well, as you can tell from my facial expression, <laughs> I didn't expect that many juices to be blown out of that. But it's all good. I'm gonna try this sticky pork rice dumpling. I think that's what it is. So it reminds me of what my mom makes at home. So I'm gonna try it. Here we go. That's really tender. Wow. Oh man, so that. Wow. Super tender, so soft. Mm -hmm. Just seeing you pick it up, yeah. it's like melting in your chopsticks. Yeah, it's just melting in your mouth. The pork is like tender, juicy. Oh. Man, I love it. <laughs> oh. oh, let's get that rib, babe. I'm gonna try that rib. Right? So the last thing that came, I almost yeah. forgot about it. Look he it. requested this it. This looks amazing. Face is everything. In this, in this restaurant, <laughs> you'll eat all their inventory. <laughs> it's juicy. It's sweet. It has that um, that, is it Chinese um, seasoning on around it? Like pink. No, I didn't eat it. I forgot what it's called. It's that, 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 it is, the char siu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really good. I love it. Um, tender. You don't need you don't need that much strength to bite down on it. Mm -hmm. It falls off the bone pretty well. Mm. Look at that. Mm. But other than that, it's good. 
We're gonna finish the rest of this. It's a Tom McCall riverfront or something like that. Waterfront. Waterfront, yeah. Yeah, we're just gonna walk around. I don't really know what's around here. He told me last minute that we're going here. So we're gonna see what's around here, see if we can get some dope shots. Okay, where are we at? Alright, so we just left the other bridge area or whatever mm -hmm. found this other cool bridge right here i don't know if you guys can see that it's beautiful oh yeah so nice so peaceful here too and then on the other side of the bridge which we actually just came from yeah they have like a drive-in movie uh, happening over there yeah. pretty cool super cool so right now we're just trying to find, take some cool photos mm -hmm. you know and yeah enjoying the weather because it's like barely any wind it's like cool breeze it is seriously perfect and it's not hot it's not humid mm -hmm. So nice. Maybe we might get some food for bed, but I don't know. We'll see. Play nice night. Alright guys, so we just got back to the hotel from, you know, the bridges and all that, taking photos and just walking at night. It was just like a peaceful walk, scenic walk, you know, it's something we don't have in our city, so it's something for us to enjoy, but uh, guys, wait a second. I think I saw a wild Snorlax. <laughs> All right, look at this. Oh damn! Should I catch that Snorlax? Should I try? I'm a starfish. It's a Pokeball. <laughs> <laughs> I need a Master Ball. This one is a, a tough one. I'm the rarest Pokemon I need, ever. I need some berries to feed this one too. You gonna need some <laughs> dim sum and some baked goods. <laughs> yeah, she's nuts, man. I, maybe I don't want this Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want you to turn anyway. <laughs> 